Webster University's SPICE team has been ranked number one in men's chess. SPICE stands for Susan Polger Institute for Chess Excellence. And joining us are Coach Susan Polger and Ray Robson of Webster University's chess team. Welcome, Ray and Susan. Pleasure being here. So, Ray, you're a student, senior this year at Webster University, so yep. you've been actively involved in the chess team. We're going to get to you in a minute because you've got um, some exciting recent news. And, Susan, you are famous here. You, you came to St. Louis five years ago or about five Almost years ago five, yeah. from Texas where you ran uh, you led a chess team there so tell us a little bit about why you came to St. Louis and to, specifically to Webster well uh, I started the the spice program uh, ten years ago uh, in Texas and then uh, about five years ago we moved the program here to Webster University we were at a stage where we were planning to move the program somewhere uh, after mm -hmm. five years in Texas and uh, it was kind of a last-minute uh, coincidence that uh, the provost of Webster University uh, approached us and uh, we decided that uh, Webster will be the best fit mm. to move the program largely because Webster is known to be a global university and the Arches program always has been and currently is as well very diverse. We have students from about 15 different countries and uh, it's, it's really diverse and for that uh, aspect among others uh, we chose Webster. So it why do you think Webster? Did Webster have a chess team at that time? No, no. At that, that was the first year that Webster was looking to start the program. And uh, also because of uh, the support that and understanding that the provost, as well as the president of the university, uh, showed for chess. And uh, the provost himself is a keen chess player and pretty good chess player. We felt that. Uh, Unlike in Texas, where football is king, right, right. Uh, being at a smaller uni private university where chess is appreciated more, uh, we feel it's a good fit for yeah. the program and, and the students. In your fifth year, I think there will be few people that don't know that this is going on at Webster University. It's been wonderfully publicized and um, it's been great for St. Louis. And we have students like Ray. So, did you? come to Webster University? Did you choose it because of the the SPICE team? Yeah, I was not at Texas Tech. I came to Webster as a freshman and um, I came mostly because um, of Susan and Paul. They, uh, even before I came to Webster, uh, they had been supporting me and giving me and my dad recommendations on how to improve, trying to help me get invitations to tournaments. So they had always been very, very supportive of me supportive of me, so I thought um, going to Webster and being with them would be a, a great choice. Yeah, so, so you really followed Susan and your co-director Paul to the university. So and how old were you when you started playing chess? I was three or four and my dad taught me how to pieces moved and I would only play against him for maybe until I was about six or seven. That's when I learned about tournaments and then that's when I started to compete um, in tournaments. Mm -hmm. Very good. And Susan, you have a very long history as a as a chess champion yourself. Started in your native country of Hungary. Is that correct? That's right. I started out myself as a player when I was just four years old, mm -hmm. kind of like Ray. And uh, I got kind of discovered as a child prodigy very early on when uh, still at the age of four, I won uh, the city championship of Budapest. Uh, for elementary school girls with a perfect 10-0 score. Wow. So that was kind of the start of my career, which eventually led to world and Olympic uh, champion titles. And uh, today I'm here in St. Louis uh, leading the number one ranked chess program in the nation and the SPICE program has won the national championship six years in a row now two for Texas Tech and the last four for Webster. And uh, is there a women's chess team as well? Uh, not separately. There is a championship that uh, in some years include women, all women teams. And uh, as such, Webster has also won that last year. Okay, so there are both female and male 
um, students who are participating in the program. That's right. Yeah, that's fantastic. Well, we're going to take a quick break, and when we come back, we're going to hear more about the plans for the program, and of course, we're going to talk a little bit about Ray's experience and career in chess as well. So stay with us at STL Live. We'll have more with Webster University's Spice Team after this break.